Hi, Javi. Good evening. Yes. Okay. How are you today? I'm fine. Okay. So now we have here, we're going to uh, discuss about, uh, um, again, what cat. We are already for a while. I have to check cat. We are in cat now. Cat 3.1. Okay. I will check. Cat listening 3.1, okay? Okay. Yes. Okay. Please be reminded, Habi, that you will, I will double check. Okay, Habi. You, we have only few lessons left. For a while, teacher is opening the. Okay, a minute, Abby. Okay, I hope you learned something from. Cat, because after cat, we will move to pet. But we have to make it little bit, little by little, so you can learn. We'll not make it too fast. Just a little. At least you learn something. Okay, how was your weekend, Habi? Where did you go? Yes. Okay, where did you go this weekend? No. Just inside the house? Um, yes. Okay, you did not go somewhere? No. Oh, at least. How was COVID in Vietnam, in your place? It... How is well. it? Okay, how was COVID in uh, how was COVID in Vietnam? It's uh, well. Okay, so I in the Philippines, you know, Javi, in the Philippines there are many, as in many cases in the Philippines, so many Javi. It reaches uh, nearly five hundred thousand. So many, so many Javi. Okay, people in the Philippines nowadays. Uh, they are not, uh, they are not, um, not, what is that? They are not trying to, to, uh, to stop from working because actually they don't have means of living. They don't have job. Okay, so if they stop working, what will be the one or how will they eat? How will they survive? They don't have money. In the Philippines, mostly in in the capital city in Manila, many who has COVID. Okay. Many. Yeah, many. Many. Okay, so I will share now. Okay, so I will share now, Habi. No, <laughs> Okay, so now we have Okay, so we are going to have the cat 3.1. Okay, it's listening, it's not reading. The last time we had reading, so now we will move to listening. Okay, so bef before that, I will have to introduce 
some questions, I mean, vocabulary words that will mm -hmm. add your mm -hmm. vocabulary. First, mm -hmm. we have soft. Soft. Do you know the word or the meaning of the word soft? Do you know this? It's an adjective. It's soft. This one is very soft. Soft. Huh? Okay, you understand soft? Adjective. Yes. Okay. Light. You know the word light. It's light. It's not heavy. This pen, it's just so light. Very light. Not heavy. Do you understand? Heavy? You understand, Javi? Yes. Yeah. Backache. Teacher Anne has a backache. Teacher Anne has a backache. Yes. It's a continuous pain in the back. If you have pain in the back, we call it as backache. Do you understand? If you yes. have pain in the back, we call it as back ache okay another band the band a small group of musicians who play popular music together often with the singer or singers it's the band okay a small group of musicians who play popular music it's the band okay you know what is band the one who play and who sing and who do the guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a band. Okay. Next. Travel agents. It's a store or it is a shop, Javi, where you can go arrange a holiday vacation. Like, I will go Singapore. I will go to travel agents. The travel agents will arrange for my travel. For my hotel, where I sleep, where I book tickets, this is the travel agents. Do you understand? Yes. Yeah. If you want to go to Vietnam, teacher Anne will ask a travel agent whom I can ask, oh, where will I stay in Vietnam? In Hanoi. Okay. What hotel in Hanoi? After Hanoi, where will I go? I will go in Danang, like that. So... That is the travel agent. Do you understand? Yes. These are the five words that you have to remember and will add your vocabulary. I will send this in Zalo afterward. Okay? Okay. Yes. Okay. Next is we have here the test question proper. Okay. I will give you five short conversations. Now we are ready to start. Please try to... Listen, okay? Okay. Listen. Now we are ready to start. Look at question one. One. When did Gary start his new job? Hello, Gary. I haven't seen you since March. Hi, Jane. No, I've been busy with my new job. Really? When did you start that? May. I left my last job in April. Now listen again. Hello, Gary. I haven't seen you since March. Hi, Jane. No, I've been busy with my new job. Really? When did you start that? May. I left my last job in April. Two. What time does the film start? Hello, Odeon Cinema. Could you tell me what time the film starts, please? Certainly. There are two screenings, one at 4.30 and the other at 7. Thank you very much. Now listen again. Hello, Odeon Cinema. Could you tell me what time the film starts, please? 
Certainly. There are two screenings, one at 4.30 and the other at 7. Thank you very much. Three. What was the weather like on Saturday? Did you have good weather at the beach at the weekend? Yes, it was sunny all weekend. Wasn't it windy too? Only on Sunday. Now listen again. Did you have good weather at the beach at the weekend? Yes, it was sunny all weekend. Wasn't it windy too? Only on Sunday. Four. Which motorway will they take? I've put the luggage in the car. Can we leave now? OK. We'll go on the M6 motorway. Isn't it faster on the M1 and then the M62? Yes, usually, but there's been an accident on the M1, so I don't want to go that way. Now listen again. I've put the luggage in the car. Can we leave now? OK. We'll go on the M6 motorway. Isn't it faster on the M1 and then the M62? Yes, usually, but there's been an accident on the M1, so I don't want to go that way. Five. Which book does Lorna want? Have you finished studying yet, Lorna? No, not yet. Could you give me that book, please? Which one? There are three here. This one on the sofa? No, the one on the chair next to the sofa, please. Now listen again. Have you finished studying yet, Lorna? No, not yet. Could you give me that book, please? Which one? There are three here. This one on the sofa? No, the one on the chair next to the sofa, please. This is the end of part one. Okay, one more. It's no. Okay now? Okay. So can you answer now? You will give me the answer? Yes. Okay. When did Gary start his new job? When? Uh, it's letter C. Letter C. It's me. Okay. Now yes. we are ready to start. Okay. What time does the film will start? What time? It is? It okay. is letter A. It is letter A. Very good. Next. What is this? What's the answer for number three? Mm, is letter B. What was the weather like on Saturday? Is, you can see the pictures. Okay. Can you see the pictures almost the same? Okay. It's letter B. It's sunny. Okay. Which motorway will they take? M1, M6, or M62? M62. Okay, it's M62. Okay, and M6 only. Which book does Lorna want? Which book does Lorna wants? It's letter C. It's letter A. The one which is under the yeah. table. It's letter A on the chair. Letter B under and letter C is here on the sofa. Okay, the answer is letter A. It's letter A. Okay. okay. Next. Okay, good job. Okay, here for question 6 to 10, you will have to listen about, listen to Sue talking to a friend about her new clothes. Why did Sue decide to buy each thing? Why did Sue decide to buy each thing? Listen. Okay, 
Okay, lesson 6 to 10. Yes. Now look at part 2. Listen to Sue talking to a friend about her new clothes. Why did Sue decide to buy each thing? For questions 6 to 10, write a letter A to H next to the clothes. You will hear the conversation twice. Hi Sue, have you been to the shops? Yes, I had some money for my birthday, so I decided to buy some clothes. I love those purple jeans. Yes, I bought them because purple is my favourite colour. I got a new jacket too. My old one is too small, so I bought this lovely big one. It's really great. Did you buy a dress? I got this one because it was only £9. <gasps> That's not expensive. Then I got a sweater to wear with my jeans. Oh, it's lovely and soft. <laughs> That's why I bought it. Anything else? A coat. The long one I have is too big and heavy, but this one is really light. Did you buy a short white t-shirt like mine? Well, I bought a long white one. I'll wear it more often than a short one. Now listen again. Hi Sue, have you been to the shops? Yes, I had some money for my birthday, so I decided to buy some clothes. I love those purple jeans. Yes. I bought them because purple is my favourite colour. I got a new jacket too. My old one is too small, so I bought this lovely big one. It's really great. Did you buy a dress? I got this one because it was only £9. <gasps> That's not expensive. Then I got a sweater to wear with my jeans. Oh, it's lovely and soft. <laughs> That's why I bought it. Anything else? A coat. The long one I have is too big and heavy. But this one is really light. Did you buy a short white t-shirt like mine? Well, I bought a long white one. I'll wear it more often than a short one. Okay, did you hear it? This is the end of part two. Did you hear it clearly? Yes. Okay, so you have the answer. You want to repeat one more? No. Okay, so we have here clothes so the these are the clothes that so both and here what's the reason why so try to buy these clothes okay it's jacket what's the reason it's letter letter A letter A sorry now look at part letter A. It's big. The jacket is big. How about the dress? It's letter C. Letter C. Okay. The dress is cheap. Okay. She buy it. Is She bought it because it's ex it's cheap, not expensive. It is sweater. Okay. Why did she buy the sweater? It's letter letter G. Letter G. It's letter H because it's soft. She likes it because it's soft, teacher. Mm -hmm. Nine, the coat. Why did so buy the coat? It, it's letter G. Letter G. Letter D. Okay, it's yes. light. It's light. Not uh, it's not heavy, it's light. That's why she likes it. The last one is the t-shirt. So why did she buy the t-shirt? Letter E. Letter E t-shirt because it is long. She likes a long t-shirt. Okay, good. Okay. Hey, good job, Bobby. Okay, here. So we have here. Okay, so next in 11 to 15, like this, as you can see, soul travel okay listen to john talking to steve about getting a student travel card oh you have this this is some sort of the student travel card okay for questions 11 to 15 you will have to check a b or c and you will hear the conversation twice two times
Okay, example, how is Steve going to London by bus, by car, or by train? So this is only example. Okay, let's have here the test proper. Okay, please tell me what is your answer for the following questions given. Now listen to the conversation. Hi, Steve. Hi, Jan. I'm going to go to London on the train. Come with me. But it's cheaper by bus. I've got a student travel card. You can get cheap train tickets with it. Well, that sounds good. How much does it cost? A card for six months is £16. So how do I get one? You need some photographs. One for the card and one for the form. Oh. There's a photo machine in the post office. It gives you four photos for three pounds. So does the one in the library. But I went to a photographer's <laughs> shop. It was cheaper. I don't have to show my passport or my driving license, do I? That's right, Jan. You only need a letter from your college. I'll ask my teacher for one. And then you take everything to the tourist office by the travel agents. Great. Next time you go to London, I'll come too. Now listen again. Hi, Steve. Hi, Jan. I'm going to go to London on the train. Come with me. But it's cheaper by bus. I've got a student travel card. You can get cheap train tickets with it. Well, that sounds good. How much does it cost? A card for six months is £16. So how do I get one? You need some photographs. One for the card and one for the form. Oh. There's a photo machine in the post office. It gives you four photos for three pounds. So does the one in the library. But I went to a photographer's shop. It was cheaper. I don't have to show my passport or my driving license, do I? That's right, Jan. You only need a letter from your college. I'll ask my teacher for one. And then you take everything to the tourist office by the travel agents. Great. Next time you go to London, I'll come too. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Okay, this is the end of part three. Is okay. Okay, okay. Number one, how much is the travel card? Because we are here, two friends, they are talking about how can they have the travel card? It's some kind of a tickets in which you will have to give it whenever uh -huh. you will. Like that. It's a travel card. Maybe like this. This one. This is the travel card. Student travel card. So, John and Steve, they are talking about getting a travel card because it is useful for them. Okay. How much is the travel card? It's letter C. Letter C, 60. The answer is... Okay. Okay, here... The answer is letter. It's not uh, given here for a while later. John will need what? How many photos? It is letter A. Okay. Next. Photos are less expensive. A. In the A. photographs, library, or in the post office. Letter A, teacher. Very good. For the travel card, John might take a blank. What? A passport? A driving license? Or what? Okay. Only a? Okay. What? Only for travel card, John must take a? Okay. You said it's a letter. So the answer is letter. You will only take a letter so you can ask for a travel card. Number 15, John can get the travel card from where? From? From? Letter B. Letter B. From the travel? Okay. From the tourist office, okay, from the tourist office. Because the tourist office, you know what is tourist office? Yes. Okay, very good. Okay. In the tourist office, that is the place where you can get your tickets, you can get your hotel bookings, 
or it could be in the tourist office you can have there all the things okay all the things which is necessary it is important you will go there okay i guess having travel card is for tourists because it's tourism it's about travel that's why okay next one here questions 16 to 20 you will hear a man speaking on the telephone okay lesson and complete question 16 to 20 you will hear the conversation two times they are talking on a telephone i don't know what happened with them <laughs> okay 16 to 20 lesson Now look at part four. Listen. You will hear a man speaking on the telephone. Listen and complete questions 16 to 20. You will hear the conversation twice. Waterhouse School, can I help you? Hello. Can I leave a message for Mr. Brown, please? Yes, of course. What's your name? David Graham. Could you spell your surname for me, please? Yes. It's G-R-A-H-A-M. Right. I've got that. What's the message? Well, I can't teach my classes for a few days because my back's bad again. Oh, dear. A bad back. Yes. Can you ask Mr. Brown to tell the students to read their course book? They should start at page 58 and read to page 73. Okay, I've got that. Uh, anything else? Uh, yes. Tell Mr. Brown that I've been to the doctor and I can't come back to work until Tuesday. That's in the morning, is it? No, not until the afternoon. I'll be there for my first class. It starts at quarter past two. Right, I'll tell him. I hope you feel better soon. Thanks very much. Bye. Bye. Okay, okay so this is about... This is about a questions of a man speaking on the telephone, okay? We have here, okay, the name of the person, number 16, this name is David Graham, okay? How about, okay, next is not in school because he has to what? Not in school because he has to what? He has to? Oh, bad back. Yeah, she has, he has a backache. Back ache. Students should read pages. What pages? Fifty-eight to seventy-three. Okay, fifty-eight to seventy-three. Very good. Okay, for a while. Okay, next. David will return to school on when? On? On when? On Tuesday. And at what time? At 2.15. It's 2. It is 2.15. It's 2. 15 okay so we have here this is all about david so we are talking about david okay let's have here for 21 to 25 you will hear some information about the pop concert you listen and complete the questions okay you know this is about music Okay, pop music. Oh, can you see that one? Oh, so many. So many people are there. Oh, my God. I can't imagine like this. Okay, here. So we have here the Beatles. Okay, the Beatles. Are you familiar with the Beatles? Okay, they are the singer in 1960s. Two, 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 two. What's that? Two old. Okay, the Beatles. I don't know if... Uh, some of them are still alive or others are already or others just 
move out from the group and they do to other they go to the other group or maybe they retired because they are old already imagine 1966 okay so we have here the pop concert it's the title of this information we have the name of the group red river in london from october 28 28 october okay so to november and the price of ticket the telephone number and the place okay now look at part five You will hear some information about a pop concert. Listen and complete questions 21 to 25. You will hear the information twice. You are listening to Radio South. Here is some information about a pop concert. The group Red River will come to London soon. They will be in London from the 28th of October to the 2nd of November. After that, they will be in Oxford from the 4th of November until the 9th. Tickets are quite expensive. They cost £37 each, but half of that money will go to a children's hospital. Tickets will sell quickly for this famous band, so book early. To book a ticket for a London concert, telephone 283-00065 between 10 a.m. and 10 p.m. Have a credit card number ready. The London concerts will be in South Bank Hall. It's very easy to find. The best way to get there is to take the train. The concert hall is in Trinity Street. That's T-R-I-N-I-T. Now look at part five. Okay, done, Abby? Yes. Okay, so we have here, what is your, we are talking here about pop concert. You were in 1960s, 66, this group of people up until now, their music, they are still in, uh, it's still, very uh very popular so they are one of those famous pop concert or the pop band or the pop singers here so we have here the name of the group is red river and it, it in london it's from 28th of october so to november what what day in november yes. It is what day on November? What day in November? Is it for November what? Four. November four, teacher and second. Okay, it's November second. How much is the How much is the price of the tickets? Is How much have we? 30? 37. 37. Okay, it's 37. Yeah. And the telephone number was? What's the telephone number? It's 2 and 3 Five. Okay, very good. And the place, where is that place? It's the South Bank Hall. Okay, it's the South Bank Hall. And in? In Tory Street. Okay, in Holly Trinity. Okay, South Bank Hall Incorporated. It's in where? It's in Holly trinity street or trinity streets okay so this one
this pop concert will held in the South Bank Hall. It's maybe a very big place where you can have the concert. Okay. So, hubby, we uh, end up here. So, uh, today, oh wait, it's cat uh, 3.1. Okay. So, actually, we are not yet done. We are going to finish this tomorrow. Okay, we are not done with this, Sabi. On next day, okay, uh, tomorrow, we are going to continue get 3.1, okay? Okay. Okay, so teacher will say goodbye. Uh, it's already time. So I will be, uh, what's that? I will be saying goodbye and I will see you tomorrow for the continuation of the cat. I will send the vocabulary vocabulary words in Zalo, okay? Okay. okay so for now, Habi, tomorrow uh, we have uh, one lessons, one lessons for tomorrow. That is the lessons left, okay? Okay, thank you, Habi, and good night. Bye-bye. Uh -huh.